All right, let's get into it. Right here at the beginning of the episode, this is the neighboring, or I guess one of the neighboring silos, and there are these dead bodies. My question is, why are the bodies here in this pattern? What killed them? Lots of dead people. Lots of dead people. Whoa. Hmm. People made it past the hill. Yeah, so so, so if, I, if I can reiterate the question, you're saying there's a bunch of dead bodies. It looks like yep. they were trying to escape the silo or something. Or, or Why is there somehow. like high density of bodies here, low density of bodies here, you know, and maybe no bodies out here? What, ha what happened? Is that the question? That's exactly the question. Like some people made it over the hill. Some people turned, like came up the stairs and then turned around and came back. Yep. So um, what, yeah, why do they distribute like this? This is actually like a, a like a science question for when you have crowds at concerts. So like, where do people mm -hmm. move when they're in these mobs? And also, it's also a question specific for Silo for how, why did they die at these distances away from the entrance? Okay, so I guess this is the best overview picture right here. Yes. So to me, gosh, the people die very slowly if they go outside. Oh, sorry, they die very quickly if they're unprotected when they run outside. I think so. Which means people r literally ran up here, and then a lot of people died near the entrance, and a few maybe the fitter people were able to run away from the entrance or maybe people that didn't or maybe people that didn't run so then their heart rate was lower so then they could survive longer they're not like sucking in whatever oh. is it gas mm -hmm. is it gas in this in the silo that makes people could die i mean what, it what has killed? to be it has to be because what else kills people quickly enough so lack of like poison food well they're not yeah. eating food poison eating. water but they're not drinking they're not drinking what's the change from inside to outside the silo I think it's atmosphere. It's atmosphere. So you breathe in poison gas mm. and then you die within literal minutes. Hmm. So I guess people like if, depending on your sensitivity to mm -hmm. to the gas, like there's an LD fifty, the lethal dose for fifty percent of the time. And yeah. some people can survive a little bit more, some people can survive a little bit less, but fifty percent of the time this much gas makes you die. Mm -hmm. And so and and then that so that that predicts like the first few people dying and then and then it gets worse after that because you have to like step over bodies and slipping and tripping yeah. i guess i guess that could explain why there's that high density right by the entrance yeah so i think this is consistent with a mob like a like a like a horde or what do you call it a stampede a stampede of people up the stairs outside and they start dying preferentially near the entrance as it's because because it's crowded hard to move some mm. people are able to get further away some people sure. double back to try to escape that's a good point because there's uncertainty like you don't know which direction to go so then you end up having yeah. a lot of milling around yeah and if people are like i'm gonna run that way and i run into people run run and then I end up dying mm. right there mm -hmm. some people are like i'll double back maybe there's something and then they get out here nothing yeah but then, and then there's also that little gap right behind the camera station, little clean right here, strip yeah. right there. Right? Yep, and that makes Corky. sense because, well, oh, really? if you wouldn't, would you run run straight line this way? Is there a purpose to running behind? I don't know. Trying to get, trying to get away, because this. I mean, there's. I, I guess if you're running and you take a glance, you're like, "There's nothing there. I thought there might be something. I'm just mm -hmm. going to keep going." I thought maybe it could be people you might want to go behind the camera pillar if there's sunlight and you've never encountered sun before you don't really you don't realize that's how true. blinding it is <laughs> but that's true i guess i don't know maybe okay, depending, okay I guess so it would depend on the time of day if it was nighttime then maybe not you think you'd see a if there was a shadow nighttime. in some direction uh -huh. you would expect to see maybe people milling a higher cluster than usual shadow. but i don't see Maybe it happened at nighttime. This 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 stampede happened out of the silo at nighttime. At nighttime, I would okay. Nighttime and new moon, so no moon. Yeah, I would expect to see the most even distribution because there's no clear any direction to go. Mm -hmm. So this to me, to my eyes, this looks fairly even, with, with the exception clustering. of, and I and I guess I guess it, the door is not centered in that cluster. 
Okay. But I guess that's right because you you generally keep walking forward more or less, yeah. right? You leave the thing and you keep going forward. Yeah. It's not like so they're this... they're born and raised on RPGs and they're like check behind every yeah. door. <laughs> mm-hmm. But I, I think I generally see okay. Given I think it's a sigmoid shape because of the sigmoid. directionality of the door, which is I'm this. A, I'm gonna look up what a sigmoid is. <laughs> okay, let's do. Let's look it up. Sigmoid. Sigmoid function. That's the wrong one. In Cardioid, 2D. I think you want. Uh, what am I looking for? That's the wrong function. Cardioid, maybe. Cardioid. Car. Dioid. Cardioid. Yeah, this is the one I want. Cardioid. Let's get that. Oh, I've been misspelling it wrong. Oh, oh, where did the image go? Uh, let's click on that. This oh, is yeah. relevant also, for sound. Also how microphones work, yeah. Yep. Okay, oh, yes. so this this so. is what I was thinking. This is the door. Mm-hmm. And you're gonna get this this bum shape centered at the door. Mm-hmm. Because people are preferentially going Forward. forward out the door right. so i think i'm seeing an okay very approximate cardioid shape here yeah where there's some preference I, and then and Plausible. then some kind of power law drop off after that or one of our type off. thing maybe it could be exponential i mean i don't want to do tell. i don't want to do the data yeah, analysis yeah. but i'm plausible plausible Possible. Cool body distribution. Hmm. Cool. I guess the other question is why? Why are the why is there this hill in the silo? Why That's a flat? good question. So it makes sense for there to be a hill. If, I mean, if I make it make sense. So mm-hmm. we're looking at the radius of the silo, and I think they just they set up these big drills and then just started drilling down. Okay. And so when you remove mass from the earth, like you remove dirt. You got to go somewhere, right? So then yep. you push it out to the sides. I guess the question that I have is why is there so little dirt? Shouldn't there be a silo's worth of dirt shoved out onto the sides? Oh, where did the dirt go? Because the cylinder right. is huge, right? It's this huge cylinder right. and you got these little hills on top. Right. So maybe, maybe the silos are built on top of coal veins. And so like they're consuming it for fuel inside the silo i i don't know how else to explain uh, that that would be weird that would be yeah. so weird oh so you're thinking i was thinking this was subsidence like it was level and then somehow the silo is subsiding and so you get this lip. Oh, could be but you bring up a good point where's the material they drilled right are they when, moving when they elsewhere? drilled they start with start with the earth they drill yeah. down but then when you make a hole that hole, that dirt goes somewhere goes somewhere so you like th- bring it up and you throw it outside, and then that maybe that this is that's what this ring is, but that's not enough. That's too, not too enough mass material. at all. And then the people who built the silo in this like emergency apocalyptic situation, why are they taking the time to properly move the I don't know debris from the drilling mm-hmm. elsewhere? That doesn't make sense. I don't know. Hmm, I don't know. Okay, I don't know. whatever silo. 